Welcome back to the Laurel Martin Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Sam Murray, joined now with Stevenson Field Hockey head coach Laurel Martin. And coach, winding down towards the end of the year, just one game left. Sitting right. at two and four in conference play, all four losses by just one goal. one goal. Two of them are in overtime. Right. Include and one one of the I was one at a loss. happy spot before I came in here. So. I'm sorry. <laughs> one of the one of the one goal losses though was to Messiah, right. who obviously is a powerhouse. Mm -hmm. Talk about your team's performance through conference play so far. So I mean I I feel um, very proud of my girls. It, it's just one of those seasons where we compete, we compete, we compete, and we just end up a step shy. Um, and uh, I think that um, our strength of schedule is really going to come and benefit us, hopefully, for this Wednesday. Uh, we were currently, um, well, not currently anymore, but as of last week, we were ranked ninth in the nation for strength of schedule. So we're playing the best teams and we're competing. Um, and, and now we need to actually secure those wins to continue on. Yeah, last time we talked, you only had four goal scorers. Uh, mm. You're now at nine. And of course, leading the way is Sarah McVeigh. She's one goal shy, yeah. tying her 15 that she scored her right. first year. Yeah. Just talk about the offensive production that stepped up through through conference play. Well, of course, we have Sarah, and she's the, the leader on the field on the attack. She's um, currently fighting through a lot of pain, and it just shows the willpower that she has because I don't even know if you can recognize it out there on the field. So she's continuing to play. She loves the sport. She loves the game. And... Um, Obviously, she's being marked up now. She's um, being challenged by some tough defenders and still being able to secure goals. So we're very happy with that. Uh, you know, we've added Marissa into the mix. Uh, she is a tough striker on our attack penalty corners. And we continue to vary up our corners based off of the defense of our opponents. Um, and then we've got Grayson, who stepped in and, and on one game had two goals and was uh, a, a great step on the attack and midfield position as well. So there's a lot. There's a lot out there that can score. We just really need to do it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So you end the regular season at Lebanon Valley, a place you right. are familiar with. Familiar, yeah. Uh, and contrary to what we thought, it's a win and end game for you. Yeah, so I made a mistake. I, I messed up the... Uh, I don't know what you want to call it, the uh, the card, shall we say. And I thought that the loss to Albright meant that we were more or less out. And thankfully enough, I was wrong. And um, won another win against Leb Val based off of goal differential and, and those other factors, we will be in. So I'm very excited for the team to be able to go out there and hopefully play um, a great game and not play with too much pressure. Uh, they need to just relax and go in there confident. Well, Coach, thank you for your time. and we wish you. you the best of luck the rest of the way. Thanks. For head coach Laurel Martin, I'm Sam Murray, and this has been the Laurel Martin Show.